a youth movement leader, Nawa Sitwala, recently passionately addressed the media here in Lusaka, shedding light on the widespread impacts of load shedding across Zambia. Mr. Sitwala emphasized that small businesses and students are among the worst affected. It is the voice of the dejected masses of our people. Therefore, the right to protest, especially against unbearable load shedding, must be protected. For the avoidance of doubt, the protest is citizen-led and non-partisan. The anger that citizens feel due to the high cost of living and now load shedding is boiling and is being kept inside. The protest will serve as a way for the dejected masses of our people to speak on this issue. We will not sit down, colleagues, and watch anyone trying to stop citizens from airing their grievances against load shedding. Meanwhile, at the same event, another member of the movement, Puta Ngalande, urged the government and ZESCO to implement immediate measures to alleviate the effects of load shedding or consider management changes within the utility. We have accepted our excuses as citizens and we have continued to, 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 to get excuses from them, uh, from them. We had load shedding in 2019. We, 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 we did not uh, air out our views as citizens in this manner and it is high time that we hold them to account because they said there were a lot of things that we were doing in long term and the lot shedding of 2019 was going to be the, way, the worst lot shedding because the next time the drought comes we would, I would be prepared. The drought is here and we are not prepared and so hence even on moral grounds some of our, our, our citizens that are employed at ZESCO should resign because they have failed to provide, uh, 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 as we say, service that they are employed to do. As tensions rise over the persistence of Lord Shedden, we'll continue to monitor developments leading up to the scheduled protest on 10th July. I am Lontia Pande reporting.